City team. And now over to Millwall. And Millwall lineup is uh, Brian Horn in goal, Keith Stevens, and Nicky Coleman, Terry Herlock, Steve Woods, Alan McCleary, Jimmy Carter, Les Briley, Teddy Sheringham, and Tony Cascarino with Kevin O'Callaghan uh, bringing up the rear, the number 11 shirt. The substitutes today for uh, Millwall is Darren Morgan and Dean Horlicks. Well, there we are, referee just ready to set the game in motion, and it's the blue shirts of Millwall that kick off. And quickly bringing their own goalkeeper, Brian Horn, into the game. Very, very uh, big match for Millwall. If Millwall can just pip full in this match, then they're well on the way to the championship. In fact, they'll get the championship. There we are, Millwall defence under pressure there, but uh, over and out on that left-hand side there, uh, Millwall getting the ball. Throw in by uh, Keith Stevens. Getting the ball down this right-hand side, a nice one too. Now then, can Jimmy Carter get round? He can't. He's, he's uh, well tackled there uh, by Peter Skipper. The whole City centre half. A long throw though. Comes across goal and it's Cascarino. In fact, Cascarino's header going for goal and handled on the line. And the referee there, no hesitation at all. A fine header there by Cascarino, but uh, pulled up on the uh, on the goal line. So it's a penalty now. This is a very, very important moment for Millwall. Can they go in front? The man looks like Ke uh, Kevin O'Callaghan to take it. So it's uh, Tony Norman there. O'Callaghan and he, does, he sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. Well, a textbook penalty and there's always a little bit of nerves in the tummy when uh, when you get a penalty and particularly in a, a match so important to uh, Millwall so Millwall take the lead 12 minutes on the clock it's Hull City nil Millwall won well a very very good uh, diving header there by uh, can Hull get this ball across well, Brian Horn did enough to put them off because it's Peter Barnes, still danger here. The ball comes across to Daniel and that was a chance. Again the ball comes in and a very, very good save there uh, by Brian Horn. Down at that near post, it was early, takes up that near position and gets the ball once again and put the one across there and a little bit of bad luck there because that was a good header, good header on there. Cascarino, oh and a good effort there, he got to hit it from over his shoulder, he hit it from over his shoulder and Tony Norman brings off an excellent serve. Chipped into that penalty area and good goalkeeping there by Brian Horn. In this last couple of minutes Millwall looked a little bit jittery. And then gets a nice ball out to number nine, Sheringham. Oh, he goes past one man as though he's not there and hits the ball. Well, that's all right. It wants collecting. <laughs> you can see how, how pushed the time all are. Quick one, two with the, that herd. And again, it's pumped towards that uh, Millwall goal. Can Millwall soak this pressure up? The ball on the halfway line again. Jimmy Carter. Plays it forward, Cascarino doesn't get there, and that's the final whistle. And that is the all-important result for Millwall. That is Hull City nil, Millwall won a penalty. Penalty after Tony Cascarino had headed towards goal, had his head uh, uh, handled on the line. Kevin O'Callaghan was the man to, to get the penalty and push it in. And there you can see the Millwall contingent. All those uh, fans have come up the M1 from London. They'll be going back tonight and they're delighted well the Millwall players in the first division the first time in the history of the club and I think the man that's got to take a bow is John Doherty the uh, Millwall manager and his assistant Frank McClintock there on a lap of honour and just look how many's come up from Millwall no crowd trouble there they're too happy to be in, in trouble 
smashing shot there in the sunshine up in Yorkshire they've done it it's Hull City nil Millwall one it's Millwall second division champions and how delighted those fans are Millwall have come from comparatively ob obscurity at, at um, Christmas time